Hello, this is Jeffrey from Ripe Color and this is Nancy Jean in the Garden. We are the Weekly Wonderings. We read on five energies every week. The energies that we read on are body, mind, spirit, grounding, and clarity. This is for the first week in November, uh, November 1st through the 7th. The second is election day in the United States. The seventh is somebody's birthday. Yes, Jeffrey. And um, a foreigner who lives in Mexico City. I can't believe I'm going to be 30. Yeah, I know. You don't look a day over 29. Thank you. Thank you. And then um, also it's Dia de los Muertes, which is um, the Day of the Dead mm -hmm. uh, on the 1st. So it should be a very eventful week. Okay. All right. Oops. Let's get a reading. Let's get a reading. Well, they're going off the board. Okay. Uh, body is like, okay, I'm getting a lot of messages. I'm getting, there, there's a lot going on. There, there's a lot of messages, a lot of creative energy. There's, um, you know, this could be... Um, you know, you're talking to spirit. There's a lot going on. And, but the thing is that this is a card of abundance. It's a, it's a card of, um, of, you know, it's almost cornucopia in a way. Okay. Body. Mind. It's like, okay, well, I'm going to take one of these things and plant it. You know, I, I'm, there's something new. There's a, there's a newness coming in that um, is exciting that I'm going to be able to utilize I, I don't really quite know what to do with it, but I'll figure it out or it'll figure me out. I'm kind of following my instinct, I'm kind of following my instinct because, you know, wands are about instinct, body, mind, spirit. Spirit says, uh, all be well, be comfortable, get settled. Everything is stable. Worry not. Mm -hmm. body, spirit. Grounding is like, okay, I, you know, Things are settled where they are, and I'm ready to move forward into the future. I'm ready to move forward into the future. But, you know, but everything is is good as it is, and it's my second eight. So there's this kind of, there's this energy of abundance and awareness in this whole week because I have two eights: body, mind, spirit, grounding, and clarity. Is um, it's almost like uh, the balance will be. Um, hmm, come to but it will be i forget my english uh the the balance will be um set mm -hmm. okay that's well, what i got what we've got we start out with in the crown chakra we have our clarity mm -hmm. and it said when the stone falls here all is becoming clear okay and ideas planted at this time will flourish. All the gifts that are happening around you are not yet recognized, but your values are being purified. So you're going to be asking the, the change and how rapidly it happens is going to be depend on how quickly you adjust to the values you need to have. Your body's settling in. It's going through some changes and it's beginning to feel much more comfortable in this new space. And you're, you're, Thoughts are very, very grounded. Once again, you're being told to let go of limitations. So if you're still holding on to something, that's getting purified out of you. And if you want to move forward in a positive way, that's got to stop. And it's because you're being dragged back by false energies of the past. But that's the that's the only, the teeny little part of that rock is the only negative thing on this board. Mm -hmm. And then at the pinnacle, at the very top, is your spirit stone. And you have, when it's there, Spirit is much aligned with your ideas and spirit is moving forward with your plans. So you just need to let go of that little thing that keeps, you know, that's that little foot we keep in our negative thoughts. Let it go. Mm -hmm. And everything's just moving forward. It's going to be a wonderful week. It's just going to be when you're finally going to see the long-term patterns we've been setting up, pulling in and becoming solidified. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Beautiful. Blessings. Have a good day. Bye-bye.